First Friday Night Frenzy of 2012, only 24 hours away. Tonight, a good preview of what's to come. We start in the Northwest Ohio Athletic League. Unbeaten Wauseon at Sw I need more cowbell. I gotta give it to me. Indians trail by seven and a half. Could it be their first loss? In the third, they go inside. Wade Woolley, two of his 13. Wauseon takes the lead in the fourth quarter. Indians take control. Trey Hendricks driving, pumping, and hitting. That's not a Trey, but it's a two. It's still good. Indians will build a double-digit lead. Bulldogs coach Matt Smith looking for someone to step up. He gets someone. That's someone with 19 seconds left. Dylan Verdell, only bucket of the game for him. It's a three-point game. After a Walsy on free throw, Travis Hilton with the tough shot. Got it. Good from three. It's a one-point game. Indians hit two more free throws. Last chance for Swanton. Hilton from half court to tie. Yeah. Wasion escapes with a 49-46 win. It was very emotional. What a, what a heated crowd, a great crowd, a great atmosphere, a big NWOL game. To, again, to their credit, they made a lot of shots. And, um, you know, we were able to step up and make enough free throws to come out in the end. Do what we always do, just play that solid defense. I mean, they hit the big three. They hit the couple big threes at the end, but we just kept our head and we didn't lose our, lose our uh, composure. All right, Swanton, I hear a little Neil in the background. That's good stuff. Patrick Henry at Evergreen. Patriots on fire early. Austin Christman hits from deep. PH up seven. End of the first. Christman again. Corner. Good. It's a 10-point game. They open up the second with the same way. This time, Colby Seaman does a scoring from downtown. Patrick Henry wins it 54-26. Delta at Ottawa Hills. Ian Tricky. It is tricky to rock around. He gets it to drop from the three-point line. Green Bears up one. And then tricky this time they cover him, but great ball movement. Eventually six foot seven sophomore RJ Coyle scores. But Alex Betts on the other end for Delta drops a three. We're tied at half, but Ottawa Hills wins 51-49.